Hi guys, back again. I wanted to finish um, the pool closing. So um, we wasn't able to do it the other day because it we got rained out. But um, we're back again. We just ate supper and um, we're gonna try to finish it. But my husband just got through blowing them up. We got two pillows that I told you about the other day. See the size of them, they're huge. I got one here and then I have one on the deck. All right, and my husband's up there getting it all together. <laughs> and I've just, um, we took the, uh, the handles, I mean the rails off the steps. And the pool don't look too bad. I've been getting all the bugs and that sort of thing out of it. But um, I will be back to show you the end result here in just a little bit. Now, if I can pause this to where I can come back. Okay, back again. I'll be pausing a couple of times while I'm getting it. All right, so the next step is I've already put all my chemicals in there. I put my alkalinity plus. I've it's shocked it. I mean, it's all good. I'm going to order a couple more of these because I put two in it last year, and like I told y'all, it still has the debris. So uh, I'm going to order a couple more and just kind of put them in uh periodically throughout the season this is the winter peel if you've never used these before i recommend you get you some one like i said i used two this year i think i'm gonna try three <laughs> overkill all right so what you do is you get it and then you just take uh, let's see i forget I think, let me look at the instructions, I'll be back. Okay, I got it. All you do is you just take this little blue thing and you pierce it. You what? In there. Okay, so this will slowly release. Um, you just throw it in the pool and it slowly releases throughout the month, or the months, okay? I'll be back. Okay, so, um, like I said, you pierce this through, but you then you got to take this out. Because if you leave it in there... It's not gonna, nothing's gonna come out. So then you just place this in the pool. Next step. Okay, we have moved on to the next step. And we are just centering it in the pool. My hubby is tying them down. He's got it already tied down. Oh, and the lights, it's already come on. All right, the next step is the cover. All right, so far, so good. Okay. So we have the cover all laid down. We're fixing to run everything through it. And then we're going to put it over the pool. I'll be back. Sorry, let me correct myself. We're going to run the, what's it called? Cable. Being politically correct. Okay, it's getting dark. <laughs> okay, guys. We got it all threaded, all right, all the way around, and now we're fixing to pull it over. I'll be back. I'll put a link down in below of um, where I got it, and I think it came with everything, the pillows and all that. If anybody's interested, um, I'll be back. All right, we had a little bit of a trouble but um we got her on there and he's working on um securing it around the deck so so far so good the wire got hung up underneath the pillow so we had to deal with that for a minute but hey it's working all right so if you have any of these clips these are really good we've used these i don't know if you can see it because it is kind of dark um, maybe it'll come into focus. These right here, we got a bunch of these. And, uh, once he gets done, he's attaching that to the deck. Um, <clears throat> then we'll pull it as tight as we can. And then we've got it, we got the pillows, um, <clears throat> we've got the pillows tied off on both ends. So once we get it real tight, then we'll move the pillows over where we want them. And hopefully that will help 
I told Daniel, I said, if two's not enough, next year I'll buy four. <laughs> we'll get it eventually. I am not draining this water every time. That's about 11 to 13,000 gallons of water. No, thank you. I'll be back. <laughs> you are the cleanup crew, babe. Another one of them right here. That'd be good. Yep. Okay, guys. So we have finished. We got a couple little things. We got to tweak it a little bit, but here's the end result. It's hard to see because it is nighttime. Um, let's see. Yeah, he's shining a light on it. So let me see if I can get it in there good. Um, so we got it sloped really good. Um, we got our pillows in the middle. I'm sorry, it's kind of hard to see. I'll have to come out here in the daytime and show you. But right here is where we're going to have to tweak it a little bit. Um, but yes, I'm very pleased with it so far. So far, so far, so far, so good. So, um, oh, that light's are shining. Uh, yeah. So, there you can see it. Yep. And you got to pull it tight because it has to have that slope or the rain will pull, pull right there and then just cause it to constantly sink and sink and sink. And then with the acorns falling from the tree and the debris, it just causes a problem. So that's the end. I'm going to document my little journey as we go through the winter months. I'm going to come out here every month and check it, see how the water is, maybe add another winter peel. My goal is to be able to open it in the spring and not have nothing in here and the water be clear. All right. Now I have to go help my husband clean up. Have a good night. Thank you guys. Bye-bye.